other side of the ball for Vandy is a Birmingham area native, Bailey McElwain, plays fullback for the Commodores, and this isn't a name that we hear often during the game broadcast, but the Hewitt Trustville alum plays a huge role in Vandy's backfield. I sat down with his family, including little brother Elliot, the Huskies running back, to learn more about this football family. Meet the McElwains. Bailey, a sophomore fullback at Vanderbilt, and his younger brother, Elliot, a senior running back at Hewitt Trustville. Both Elliot and Bailey are just tough kids, tough, hard-nosed football players. The brother duo shared the field for the Huskies for two seasons, where Bailey dominated on defense before moving to the backfield in college, a change that's brought the brothers even closer. He's kind of like a coach to me, just like helping me out. He has the password to my huddle, so every time film pops up, he'll go through it, give me notes. This weekend, Elliot will make the trip to Nashville to watch his brother play against his lifelong favorite team. Oh, I'm, I'm going to side with my brother this weekend because of my family, my blood, but um, I'll, be, I'll be cheering for Bam a little bit in the heart. As for the boy's mom, Juanita, an Alabama graduate, there's no wavering when it comes to who she's siding with Saturday. I think it's probably a given. Um, I'll be cheering for Vandy, go doors. Um, rooting number 39 on. For this busy football mom of three, it's a common occurrence to spend Friday night at a prep game and hit the road Saturday for Vandy football. And she wouldn't have it any other way. I always said at the very beginning when the boys were growing up, um, my boys would never play football and they would never have long hair. And I've eaten those words on both. So, um, to watch them grow and love the game as I look back and look at the little jerseys and especially as they're seniors you always reminisce about some of the old times and how little teeny tiny they were just the excitement that's been there all along and that excitement has continued for both brothers out of the backfield is the fullback McElwain. Bailey started every game his freshman season for the Commodores scoring two touchdowns in key SEC wins <laughs> Elliott has scored seven touchdowns through just three games for the Huskies, who are undefeated on the year. They always have a great attitude. And they, bring, uh, they bring their A game every single day to work, whether it's the, the weight room or whether it's uh, you know conditioning in the summer or if it's practice. Th th those guys, I mean, 99% of the time, they're, they're bringing you know, their, their best effort. It just feels like the time is now. I mean, last year we had a good shot, but we just couldn't finish it. But I feel like the time really is now. And if we have a shot to do it, it's right now. And for Elliott, it's now or never, as the Husky superstar heads to Army next season, making college football Saturdays even busier for the boys' mom and younger sister, Emma Grace. Go with the flow and see what happens and see where games are and decide from there. When Elliott said it was Army, I, you know, I told him, I'm not sure that we'll make as many games as we made for Bailey. With the McElwain brothers headed in different directions, it's easy to reminisce on when they wore the same jersey. I have a great picture of the two of them on the field. You know, one of, one of those last years that they got to be on the field together. And those games were so exciting. And you just relish each and every one of those moments because they're not going to be there for very long. Well, that is going to be a very busy football mom next year when she has one kid playing at Vanderbilt and then one at Army. But when you talk about Elliot McElwain, it's a guy who doesn't get a whole lot of pub, but it's kind of like Jay Prosh was at Auburn a few years ago. I mean, he makes that offense go. It still works well for the Texans, Prosh does. Yeah, you got to have a fullback in what Fandy tries to do. I'm, I'm interested in what Emma Grace is going to do as well. Is she, <laughs> she is plays she tennis. Be, she does? Yeah. A great tennis star. You know up. what mom's got to do, right? She's got to call Derek Mason and just plead, how do we get Vanderbilt and Army to play a game against each other the next that year? That would be cool. That would be really cool. All right.